Hey guys, the new here. I know this isn't a good angle, but I just want to try out this mini tripod I got for Christmas. Um, I I don't really want to take a picture of it. Just imagine my huge tripod. Now shrink it down to like eight inches. There you go. You got the tripod I got. But um, just like last year, I'm gonna be doing Christmas cubes unboxing. Last year I got seven cubes, but this year I got three, and I really like the cubes I got. So. First we have the Google on 2x2 in black. I actually asked for like the newer version where like you could set it up and everything. But I don't really care if I got the original or not because my old one was really bad anyway. So I thought why not get a replace? So I thought it's fine if I just get a replacement or something. Now we have this Z cube 1x1x3. This is really cool because I actually had this for a birthday present in January. It was a late birthday present. And it broke like two days later when I was being really stupid. And last but not least, we have the Chihi Wuji 7x7. This is the most exciting one because this is my first 7x7 that like isn't a really bad budget one. Because if I pull out my 7x7s right now, um, I have a Shinsha one in the basement and this Mo Guanfu. Like, it's okay, but I feel like I probably, if I want to get into 7x7 more, I probably should get the Wuji. So. Yeah, let's open up the Wuji 7x7. Um, I think somebody told me this, but I actually have all of the Wood Line cubes now. I have the 2x2, Wuxia, and M. And I have the Wu Chui, Wu Shuang, Wu Hua, and then now the Wuji. So, yeah, um, I'm just going to put this off to the side because, yeah, this is the least exciting, so I'm just going to open this one up first. Um, I like the packaging where it's just like a little face. Oh, it looks like we got it in white. Well, I'm pretty sure I probably could have t um, tell from that because of the little peek inside. Oh, that's cool. So there's a shade of black. And okay, the turning is like not half bad. Um, I guess I could just do a solve on here real quick. Yes, I do know it is like the moving around floppy cubes where like it shape shifts and everything. But. I mean, floppy cubes are just kind of a novelty puzzle. Like, they're pretty cool, but like I said, they're just a novelty. So, yeah, I'm. this is like a pretty cool puzzle. I just thought it would be funny if I got it again. And let's hope I don't break it this time. So, yeah. Uh, I actually have not solved one of these in so long. Because I didn't like see one at Dixon or anything. So... I never actually have done one in so long. Oh, look, I did it. Okay. Yeah, it's just one by one by three, novelty puzzle, whatever. Uh, I'll definitely be keeping this box, though, because it's really cool with the faces and everything. Still have my box collection. I'll show you that in a separate video. Here we have the Guoguan 2x2, you know. Um, it's funny how we go from, like, one by one by three, two by two, all the way up to seven by seven. And... We got a stupid pamphlet. That's in the trash. Um, come on. You can come out already. Uh, do I have to open it from the other side now? Because it seems like the thing does not want to come out. Uh, I don't really feel like editing this, so... Just like skip ahead like 10 seconds like multiple times if you just want to skip this but you don't have to so yeah come on get out I don't want to damage the box but it kind of looks like I have to mm. This is so hard to open. Okay, good. We got it. Um, now will it come out? Okay, there we go. Um, I don't even know if I want to keep this box. But, I guess. Okay, now it's back. I can keep it just for. Bleep! And stuff like that. Uh, sorry about swearing. I, I... Shoot. <laughs> that was my accident. Um. So we open this up. And now we have the Gogon 2x2. I've actually 
not felt a good one in a while, so why not try it out? Mm, it's pretty good. It's still locked stuff out of the box as usual. Um, but it's not that good. Like, it's okay out of the box, but I just have a bad problem with locking issues and stuff like that. Okay, let's put that off to the side. And, uh, we have the Wooji. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's all I have to say. We have the Wooji. Uh, like I said, this is the most exciting one. So, yeah. Uh, shoot, I, I ripped the box. Well, sometimes you have to make sacrifices for the things you love. Um, yeah, so... This is some of my seven. We got plastic wrap. Uh, this is pretty. Uh, why does why do companies make it harder and harder to take off plastic wrap nowadays? I just don't like plastic wrap in general. I'm not, like, the people that, like, say that they want plastic wrap when there is no plastic wrap and don't want plastic wrap when there is. And, um, yeah, the streets are pretty cool and everything, so let's try this out. Okay, so the outer layers are obviously not good at all. They're really bad, actually. They're, like, really sandy and they're really rough and everything. Inner layers are actually pretty good. Um... If I'd say so myself, the inner layers are way more better than the outer layers. By a lot. Well, um... I've heard from people the very middle layer is not good at all. Um... And I kind of see their point, but... Then again, they say that on a 6x6, this is a 7x7. Um... I'll definitely do like an average of 5 on this sometime soon or something. But... Those are the cubes that I got today, so yeah, thank you guys for watching, and cool.